everybody. It's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and it's our daily card reading for September 18th, 2021. Let's see what we have. Oh, oh that's flying right out. Wisdom. It's here. It's here. But see, here's the thing. The time is not actually linear. And so I know we all get really, um, we love getting in this whole anticipation mode. Look at, tw uh, what was it, 2012? <laughs> I almost said 2020. 2012, where everybody was like, end of the world's coming, end of the world's coming. The grand shift. And every spiritual person that had never been validated is like, here's my validation. Open all the wisdom skulls and... <laughs> Let there be beams of light and show these people that I wasn't joking. And then what it seemed like nothing happened. But that's absolutely not true. Big things happened. Look how different you are as a person now than you were back then. Look at how the world has changed since then. So this is uh, our wisdom having a place to come to. We need to prep the way we show up, this existence, yes? Get ready for the wisdom to come through. As I was saying, you know, we like to have the anticipation of an event. It's going to be an event, you know, and even as I just said, it's here, right? Like that's, that's part of it, but it's always been here. And YouTube content, let me use this as an example. YouTube content is always, in my mind, a good gauge of where we are. If people are ready for the deep stuff, there's a lot of deep, deep <laughs> knowledge, wisdom that's out there. Those videos don't often get seen. Why is that? Well, you know, people go into this whole, it's shadow banning. It's all, I don't know, maybe. But um, it's more, I think people just aren't ready to hear it or they don't understand it. So it doesn't make them bad people. They're just not ready to understand it. Where are Where is a lot of humanity? They're in the cracking open the surface level of their story. What is a powerful tool for that if used correctly? Tarot. Psychic readings. Again, I, I know people who do those kinds of readings. And they're beautiful people. Um, oh, 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 gosh, oh, gosh, gosh. Jess, is it Jess Puckett, the Chaos Witch? Uh, she's a tarot reader. And she does, like, love readings. And usually I'd be kind of like... I gotta watch that kind of stuff, but she is so insightful, you guys, and she, yeah, she's doing that, like, sort of, I don't want to call it trendy, it's not really, well, I don't know, but that's kind of where people are, I guess it's not fair to call it trendy, um, but she does it in such a responsible, beautiful way, and the stuff that comes through her readings, it's amazing, and I think she only has, I don't even know, like, 20, what does she have, like, 23,000 subscribers, interesting, right? Uh, so shout out to her. Go check out her channel. Make sure you subscribe because she deserves the subscribers, okay? <laughs> and liking her videos and, you know, helping her out that way. But this this is just an example to my point that here's somebody who's doing it very responsibly and is incredibly insightful. Why aren't there more subscribers? <laughs> like, why aren't more people going over there? And yet, and I'm not going to call anybody out, but I have come across other channels where, it's not bad. They're, what they're doing is not bad. They're tarot readers. And they're fascinating. They're just fascinating to watch. They're just not going very deep. Nearing a million subscribers. Right? So again, it doesn't have... Some, there are some tarot readers. You know I'm like like the big mama bear about the irresponsible readers. But, you know, I'm not talking about them. But I think it's an interesting thing to look at. That the people that have the most energy coming in and people want to see what they're doing um it's very lighthearted. um it's very temporary it's a temporary message um stay surface level so people are still most likely processing that surface level message right whatever that is for them um and then again some of these astrologers out there i can't believe that joni patri doesn't have a million subscribers you know, I mean, she does Vedic astrology. Again, get out there and check her out. She's amazing. She has all this wisdom and she's just so, <laughs> like, she, she hits it on the head. You know, her tool is very, very valuable. 
And, you know, she's somebody who doesn't have nearly as many as she should. It's not really about, and please don't miss the point of what I'm saying here. It's not about who's more popular. I, I'm just saying that this can be an interesting tool about what people are engaging with. And because this is such a huge platform, I think it gives us a good social study uh, and, and a spiritual study about what people are wanting to hear. Now, if you're somebody out there who has a YouTube channel, um, you know, and you don't have a whole, and you kind of do this work and people are not really subscribing or what have you, and maybe you do the deeper messages or you do, you know, looking at the hard hitting stuff, it's going to be all good. It's going to be all good. People are where they are. So anyway, we'll just leave it there and I shall see you guys tomorrow. Sending you so much love and take care.